Hey viewers! In today's tutorial, I am going to show you, how to create this hot neon light animated GIF image with Photoshop. I have created this image for my blog header. I am working on Photoshop version CS6 but any CS version can create this image. To start, open a new 815 into 320 pixel document. Document size can be according to your project need. Press Shift plus Backspace to open Fill, and fill our background with black color. Now grab a nice smooth brick wall texture image, as neon effect looks nice on dark backgrounds. I have this image. Drag and drop it on our background. Adjust it. Hit enter. Drop its opacity to about 68%. It's all up to you to decide how bright you want background to be. Now select the text tool and type your text with white color. Use some smooth italic font. I'm using aka Dora font. Type with some nicely large text size. Move and adjust it as you feel is better. Now open layer style and give some effects to this text, that is Photoshop in my project. Go to color overlay and choose some nice light color. Color choice is up to you. I select a nice light pink. Keep the blending mode to normal and opacity to 100%. Now go to outer glow. Blending mode is set to normal and opacity to 100%. Select a nice bright color for outer glow. Whatever color you choose for outer glow, it should be a nice bright color and a matching shade with our color overlay. I select a bright red. Now let's give a drop shadow to our text. Set the angle to 90 degree. Distance to about 20. Set the blending mode to multiple, and opacity to 70%. Spread to 15, and size to about 4. Click OK to finalize these effects. Now rasterize this Photoshop layer by going to Layer, Rasterize, Type. Now click on our text that is Photoshop layer while pressing Ctrl key. That will make a select over the text. Now got to select. Modify. Contract. And set the contract value to 3. The contract value again depends upon size of your font. Click OK. Press delete key. 
That will delete the contract selection. Press Ctrl plus D to deselect the text. We have completed all effects for our first text type. Now select Type Tool and type second text. I'll type FX. Adjust its size as per your project need. Now go ahead and give it the same effects as we have given to our first Photoshop text. But choosing different colors this time. Slight changes and drop shadow as well. Click OK. Now rasterize this layer and contract same way as we did with our first text. Now we have finished our neon text effect. Now we need to make it an animated image. To do that open animation timeline. Here our main two texts are showing in frame 1. Click here and make a new frame. Keeping our frame 2 selected, reduce our FX text layer's opacity to about 10%. Set looping option on forever mode. Set the frame change to 1 seconds. Play. You can see our FX text is going off and on. It already look awesome. You can go ahead and save this image like this, or can make some animation FX. To do that, select FX text layer and duplicate it by pressing Ctrl plus J. Also duplicate our Photoshop text layer, and drag it to the top. Now basically what we are going to do is, adjust our each text layer to set how they look on each frame. while keeping our frame 1 selected. Hide Photoshop copy layer. 
set our Photoshop layer's opacity to 100%. FX layers to 10%. FX copy layer to 10%. Selecting Frame 2 Photoshop Copy Layer to 100% FX Copy Layer to 10% FX Layer's Opacity to 100% Hide Photoshop Layer Now click here to make new frames Selecting Frame 3 Hide Photoshop layer FX layer to 10% FX copy layer to 100% Set Photoshop copy layer opacity to 10% Selecting Frame 4 Hide Photoshop Layer FX Layer Opacity to 10% Hide FX Copy Layer Set Photoshop Copy Layer Opacity to 10% Set frame changing time to 1 seconds for all frames. Looping time set on forever mode. Play. There we see the sexy looking neon on an off text effect. Go ahead and save it by selecting Save for Web. Make sure the format is set as GIF. Click Save. And we are done. Hope you enjoyed watching this tutorial. Please leave your comments and do let me know what you think about the image. Please also like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.